Yeah, good morning. When I look into the room here, I first have to do to welcome also our colleagues in the live stream. So welcome. But I have to use my authority as a host now to ask you all to come a little bit more forward. You're a little bit too distant away. Well, actually, that means you have to move. <laughs> There's also that two tables. How many invitations do you need? Yeah. Because later when we have a panel discussion, it looks a little bit awkward when we speak to the back of the room and also to some people in front of the room. So. Okay, thank you for, for coming in. May, let me, I will keep it very brief and short because first I would like to welcome you here at GND. Um, my role here is to be the host today because when Gabi asked me whether we can use this hall here for the Concordia event, I say yes, sure, because it's important to do events like this, right? But I want to give you a little orientation on where you are. You see that little black and white pictures here in the room. Of course, you in, this, in the live stream, you can't see that right now. But this is what we call Hall 6. Hall 6 was the hall where we printed the Euro a few years back. So a security product, which is still existing today, but in today's world, we see many other different products when it comes to payment, right? You have digital payment means, you have everything. And that probably stands for the company here, right? Because we come from physical products and creating confidence in these areas. But today in this com campus here, we have 2,200 people and practically half of it are in R&D, engineering, or IT. So we have crypto laboratories here. So we develop um, high secure code. Um, and we actually produce products for making the world a bit more secure. When you have an Apple device like an iPhone, and you saw the recent announcement of the iPhone 14, I think the, the reason why Apple can connect the, the watch the iPhone and the tablet is not because of developments in Cupertino, but because of developments here. Things created in Munich on this compound here. And it's actually pretty cool. That's the reason why I actually have a uh, watch, uh, because it's, it's our product, right? And whenever somebody unpacks a watch, it's revenue for GND. And that's something very new, because if you come from the physical world and produce products which are paid per piece, or when you have software as a service model, it's a very different thing. And you have to have a different, let's say, DNA to develop that. And um, one of the parts is on the Cybersecurity Act is have security by design in it, right? And um, we have to think it from the beginning and from the end, both, right? And how to design this. And this was one of the biggest challenging things to do it with a company like Apple, who have very strong demands. But don't, we don't want to be dependent on Apple, so we come to resilience. We also have other customers in this area, right? But so far, enough about GND. To pick up on the points you made, um, the BSI, the German Institution for Security in the Information Technology, issued their annual report a few days back. And the report was not showing good news, right? Because the world is getting more digital, but also the profile for threats are increasing tremendously. And it's no wonder because the world is getting more digital, more connected, and at the same time, you have a lot of geopolitical issues at the moment. They don't really help to make the world more secure. And that's the reason, actually, why I like it so much that we have events like this here, because in my other role, next to being the CEO of GND, I do a lot of other work in order to bring people together to help to make structures more secure, right? And bringing companies and providers of security technology together is something very important, in particular for Europe. And probably ending with a quote we heard yesterday, Gabi, we were at the same event, um, where Ambassador Ischinger of the Munich Security Conference spoke and said, well, in Europe, and we are all from Europe, right? In Europe, we have to understand that we have small countries, and they understand that they are small, maybe the Netherlands, and other countries which haven't understood that they are small too. Because if you look at Germany, Germany spends a lot of money in R&D and technology. Maybe we are big in Europe, but on a global scale, we are small. And we all have to understand that. That's the reason why we have to work together in Europe to make more of our we have and talents in money and technology from here. 
Without that thinking and without that mindset, we don't move anything. And with that, Gabi, I hand over back to you. Wish you all good days here in Munich, fruitful discussions for a joint ambition we have, right? Make the world more secure. Thank you very much.